Hello guys, I am the Kegman. Welcome back to another episode of Sons of Yorick. And we're going to do this again uh, with Mr. Halfdan over here. Uh, as you can see, the game is on Iron Man. Achievements are enabled. And we're going to get straight back into this. So, previous episode, um, it was just constant war. We couldn't get ourselves a power base. We'd basically run out of men. And uh, everyone's just basically picking us apart, effectively. Uh, today, we don't have that issue. Um, we're going to start over. We're going to try and expand north into Alba. Um, like I say, it's a bit more whole. It's an actual kingdom to begin with, and they do have uh, a few men at the start. Um, that's what we're going to do. Uh, to begin with, though, we need to get all of our boys heading over here. So we need to siege down this land uh, in North Umbria. Uh, we're going for North Umbria. Uh, there's our brother's men, uh, Jarl Ivar, uh, who has the Isles. He's going to try and take uh, this land up here. Uh, so we are going to go for North Umbria, take North Umbria, and then we're probably going to start picking off bits of land, maybe in Northern Ireland, and then into Scotland. Now, we do have a subjugation that we could take, and I do want to take it. Uh, Marshall-wise, apparently they've gone straight into Gallant, which is a little bit annoying. I prefer Benham Justin. Uh, so it means I can laugh this off and do some other things. Uh, but it's okay. We'll carry on with this anyway. Uh, we're going to take the prowess plus three. And as soon as we can, we're going to take Bellum Justin. Uh, we are currently unmarried. Or we've got an heir who's unmarried. Let's uh, divorce our wife. And we've got an unmarried heir. So we're going to get our son married to the Yardam of Zealand. To my niece, apparently. Uh, which is a fairly nice uh, alliance to have, I guess. And we're going to get ourselves married to the um, Vestergotland, Opland, Vestfold. Um, we'll go with you. Yeah, we'll go with you. Fine. That's fine. Uh, while we're here, we'll go ahead and get ourselves a few more alliances as well. Uh, Opland, cool. Uh, we have you as well. Hitzerk, Alliance Power. Uh, Yard with the Isles, my nephew. Wonderful. Oh, shit. Do I want to do that? No, I don't want to do that. I want to be fighting the Isles at some point. Uh, we're going to go with Hastening, hopefully. Hopefully that will override it. Um, you're married. You're somewhere else. Uh, let's go back to you. Let's go back to you. And you're married as well. Okay, so we've done what we can, uh, effectively. Take Concubine, negotiate alliance with Jarl Bjorn. So we'll get Bjorn Ironside on board. Need some champions, so we'll go ahead and invite those. And whilst we are what we are, we can get some Men at Arms regiments nice ones uh, we will go ahead and get another one and another one and finally a another one now I know they are four minute arms regiments and I know they're only 100 each but I think I'm gonna go that way around we do have 5,000 men we can raise as well so let's go ahead and do that and uh, let's head our way over to Lancashire uh, so we have just unpaused and that was probably a mistake because I do need to look through Chancellors, etc. Uh, that's the best one I've got. Uh, Mayor Halston uh, will go for a. We're going on the wrong thing here. Uh, 14. Yep, yeah, cool. Double. A recruit to court here. Uh, so we'll assign you. And finally, our stewards. I think the Hoff God is about as good as it gets. You're an 8, and I can recruit someone else. Um, Uber. Hi, mate. Um, I'm going to find you a spouse. In a chieftain Vestfold. But I need you to kind of hang around. I want you here. Just to let you know. We do have some alliances turning up. Which is very, very nice. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to go ahead and... Um, call them for this. I don't think we're going to need to. They've got 2,000 men. We've got 7,300. I don't think we need to call them for this. So I've got other men I could raise over here, so... Uh, right, but first of all, uh, the 940, I'm going to go over here, I'm going to split this army into two, then them here, we'll speed this up a touch, so like I say, uh, his men have gone and disappeared, uh, we do actually have an ally here, I don't think I called him, but he's apparently decided to join us, okay, fine, if he wants to join us, he wants to join us. Uh, obviously, we want to siege down this land ASAP. So, 2,400 men to here. And the 977, I'm going to send straight into... Uh, actually, I'm going to send to Durham. Otherwise, they'll get attrition. Uh, let's send you... No, she will send you over here, because of the things that are weaker, you are the weakest. It makes sense, really, to me. 
bolster up the weak a lot. And we'll send you over here to kill these guys. We'll get you a commander in uh, Mayor Olafa. Uh, you've sieged that down. Let's go ahead and siege Annandale. Want to siege as much land as I obviously want to siege as much land as possible. We need to take the capital though. And then I'm going to murderate the people we've captured because I want piety. Uh, so we've taken Annandale. Someone else is sieging down here. That's Jarl Ivers host, but we're going to move them out of the way and take that ourselves. We are at 100%, but it doesn't matter to me that they've also taken that land. Uh, so we've taken Elfka's son and heir, Ella, uh, hostage. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and just kill his children. No, 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 not release, uh, sorry. Not bad, my bad. We have anyone of our... These are, none of these are going to be related to us, it's fine. Uh, so mass execution, wonderful. And then we'll go ahead and enforce the demands. And I do believe that... Uh... Nope, he's not. I mean, we must have killed his dad already. I must have murdered his old man, so he's not the old man, is he? That's Ella. I just I straight up killed him. I was supposed to blood wing him, uh, blood eagle him, but I didn't. My bad. All uh, right, so we're going to disband those boys, and we're going to probably go straight over here. Now, he has got an alliance with Neef, but we have more men. So we go... Oh, we go, can I do it by county? We need to get our prestige up. Okay, so what we're going to do then is we're going to raid big time. We're going to go ahead and raise everyone as a raider, and we're going to go through lands like nobody's business. Uh, so let's head down into Mercia. Take out a bit of their army, get a bit of money. Uh, head over here as well. Now, I don't actually know if they fixed this. I need to, I don't know if you know, we've got a load of men over here that we're not currently using. So let's move these boys back in to our own land. Just, just very, very quickly, uh, speed this up. Now, what I want to do is raise the rest of my army. So you can't actually turn these guys into, oh, apparently you can now. So you never used to be able to turn those into raiders, you used to have to join them up. Uh, but apparently they're going to be together as raiders, which is useful. Uh, so let's head, let's just pause this a second. We've raided this land here, I want to raid this land here. We're going to go through those boys. And we do have a new martial perk available, so let's go ahead and take that. It's the Bellum Justum, which is going to be very useful very soon. Um, first things first though, we do want to get our prestige up. Now, getting our prestige up means we can go for dukies as opposed to individual counties, and I want to take that entire dukedom in one swoop. Um, but we need to get our prestige up. We can also get our money up doing this, obviously. So let's get, get our money going. And we've got a fairly safe bunch of men here. I don't think there's too many people who can take on uh, 5,500 men in one go. Uh, capture skill slaves for Jorvik. Uh, we'll take the plunder, actually. I mean, development's useful, but not where we are right now. This is more useful at the moment for us. Uh, so let's go over here and siege this as well. And we're going to decline all of these battles because we don't need to be getting involved. Take uh, bounty's plunder. That's pushing us up towards distinguished. I can't remember what we need. It's the one after distinguished we need. Not distinguished, but the one after. I can't remember what it's fucking called. Uh, so let's go on to Anglesey. There's a couple of bits here we can siege down. More bounteous plunder. How much money have we got? 169. So it'll be 169 prestige as well as the 169 uh, gold. And obviously we're, we're doing a lot of work here as well. Um, by uh, sieging all of this down. Uh, we'll grant the tax lenience. It's fine. Bit more land. They're going to come and fight us, apparently. All 479 against 4,000. Hopefully we'll get a, a couple of... Uh, we didn't. And we just got gained a faith level. I was hoping to get a couple of prisoners, but we didn't get those. And, right, okay. So, 246. We'll make this one over here the last one, possibly. Actually, no, we'll make this the last one. And then we're going to head back, because we have lost a lot of our special troops. Which is a, uh, a big issue, really. But... Not that big an issue. Because we've got 277 uh, gold, and we're about to land. We've gained a level of fame towards... Uh, well, we've gained quite a bit of fame. So if we disband now, I need to actually hand out some land too. And uh, yeah, we'll have ourselves a bit of money to work on here. To gain a few more 
men at arms now we're more two of five I want to do anything else no uh, we've disbanded all of them lovely uh, so uh, we have sons un unlanded sons at that we've got a landed son over there who's no good to me because I don't know where the fuck he is uh, but we do have a son here we're gonna land in Moreland and not Durham we're gonna land him on this side of the land there we go. Well done, you. You've gained all that land over there. Uh, we have a son here as well who's going to get grant lander titles in Northumberland and Durham. Well done, you. Now we're back to three of three, and we've got a couple of vassals who are of our, uh, what do you call it, dynasty. So, uh, barony of you, uh, we need to be uh, illustrious. So we need to get our fame level even higher. So, first things first. Let's go on a... Do you want to go on a pilgrimage? Yeah, we'll go on a pilgrimage. That's going to get our oppressed piety up. We need to get our piety up? Probably not. We can do piety, do without piety for now. Let's get a feast on the go. And um, we should get at least 150 prestige for this, depending on what happens during it. Um, we just got 150 prestige and plus 20 opinion from all of our vassals. Uh, let's go for a hunt as well. 67 gold. We've got ourselves a new martial perk. We will take movement speed, because that's incredibly useful. And we gain 75 uh, prestige for chasing a boar. Another 75 for pressing on. What's this over here? And we killed a boar. Lovely. Uh, we're going to get paid 25 gold. Wonderful. We've got anyone else we can ransom off in a minute. You won't do that, though. What about you? Will, will you pay for Isabel? Apparently not. Right, okay. and then we get another 150 prestige. So, yes, it's about halfway towards illustrious, which isn't too bad. Uh, if we move our rally point, uh, we're going to go to where are we going to attack? Where are we going to attack? We'll, we'll go probably the west coast of Ireland, I guess. We'll click on here. No gold. Okay, maybe we don't go to Ireland then because apparently. I mean, you've got 15 gold here, but most of Ireland seems to be uh, completely, well, <laughs> stripped. I suppose we could go across sea and uh, head into East Anglia. There is that. So if we raise all here, uh, we've got raise all, uh, all armies, done that. Turn into raiders. And we'll head out into the sea of Norfolk. You can see that Lincolnshire has been... Uh, kind of raided already but let's make our way i'm saying norfolk's been kind of rinsed too we've got a couple of places we can go to isn't the worst thing in the world we're going to gain any attrition here going to cambridgeshire no useful bit of money bit of gold uh bounteous plunder thank you very much bit of prestige essex has been absolutely uh gutted let's head out to uh oh I want to go to France, but France could be a bit of an issue. Uh, let's go to Brittany. Uh, Brittany might not... Oh, hello. Brittany's been raided as well. Let's head to this part of Brittany then. And we've got Cornwall. And uh, we've got the capital here. So if we go to Cornwall, it's a nice 19 gold, which is obviously a nice 19 prestige. 17 gold here. And everything else has been raided. Uh, bring me bounties plunder. Like, honestly, it's, it's crazy how much raiding gets done. I suppose we've got uh, Leon. Uh, over here, which we could raid, and the uh, the bishopric, bishopric next to it of Saint Paul de Leon. Uh, that was breast, actually. Don't mind a bit of breast. Of course, a cheesy, easy joke. Uh, Cornwall's been completely done. Apart, well, Cornwall's been done, but Devon hasn't. Got a few bits in Devon we can try to take. 121 of 310. And finally, the Barony of Exeter before we head back to. The wonderful north. So, head up there. Illustrious. Will we have enough to tick us over too? We don't. We're still a long way away. Uh, let's go through uh, Jorvik then, uh, as we are not... I don't think we're allied to Jorvik. We are allied to Jorvik. Okay, can we go to any of these here? Any of these worth going to? I suppose we could go to these. I think going to Sterling might be the wrong decision. Bring me Bounteous Plunder, of course. Uh, Dunfermline could be the right way to go. Uh, bring me Bounteous Plunder. Nice. Double Bounteous Plunders. Uh, we'll go to Dundee. Although I, I understand, uh, based on what my Scottish friends have told me, no one should ever 
want to go to Dundee. Let's go ahead and run. Actually, no, let's, I want to try and get living off the land done because that's a uh, healthy and useful um, raiding uh, bonus there. Uh, you grow closer to forming. Uh, you spend 75 gold. We rebuild the East Riding. Lose 30 gold. I'll just rebuild it. That's fine. And we've got 16 over in Banff. 15 in Moray. Bring me Banff's Plunder. The only problem is we're getting very low on men. So I'm going to have to rest them in a bit. We'll take Sutherland. Oh, we go Ross and then Sutherland. We'll avoid the free uh, the free gold here. We'll take Ross and then Sutherland because I feel like uh, maximizing my gold potential while I can. I've only got free there as well. So don't worry about that. So let's head out to sea and let's head back into Northumberland. And we should hopefully now... No, still haven't matched it. Uh, only 89 gold and 89. Uh, okay, uh, let's drop our men, disband all. We got anything we do here. Go on to pilgrims. When we do feasts, 876, the next year, and a hunt in two years' time. It might be a case of raiding again shortly. Uh, but we are going to go ahead and increase the size of our army. Uh, it does mean we are losing a lot of gold a month, but as long as we keep raiding, that is not an issue. Uh, Lindsay is part of East Anglia, so could we conquer the county of Lindsay? We could. Let's go ahead and do that. It's a bit of money, potentially. Um, there's a lot of men there. Let's try and get our allies involved. So we'll ask uh, Jarl Ivar to come in. We'll ask, you know what, we'll, we'll ask Yelland and we'll ask Upland here as well. Uh, we can modify some contracts. Wonderful. Rand, half Dan Ragnarsson. Uh, I would like more levies, and I am going to use my hook on you. Wonderful. This is my sons, aren't they? Which is why I've, got, I've just got if three hooks on them. Um, so we're going to use that hook as well. We'll go over an alliance with you. Where are you from? Lanarkshire. No. No, because you are in Strathclyde, aren't you? Is Lanarkshire Strathclyde? No, it's, Yav uh, it's Jorvik, but I still want to take that at some point, so no is my answer there. So we've got some men joining us. Uh, they've got slightly more men. Their commander is... I don't know who, but we're going to go down here anyway. This is occupied by... Who is this occupied by? Uh, Vasta Gotland. So one of our uh, fellow um, Norse men is down here. It's okay. We've just sieged it down. Uh, let's go into Norfolk. As we need to. You can see our allies are actually sticking with us now. I still think it's a, 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 a an issue with the older uh, version of the game. And we do have Edmund. Oh, by the way, uh, Petty King Edmund, this dude here, uh, he is the reason Barry St. Edmunds is called Barry St. Edmunds, for the people who don't know. Uh, so, uh, the capital of Ipswich was at one point, uh, sorry, capital of Suffolk was at one point, uh, Barry St. Edmunds, or East Anglia indeed. Um, so, yeah, we've just captured the uh, king. Now, in real life, uh, he was made a saint because he was shot full of arrows. He believed that his... Uh, his faith in God, or that God would protect him, and that he wouldn't die. And obviously, what happened is he got shot full of arrows, and then he died. Uh, so guess what's going to happen to him? Uh, I can't actually shoot him full of arrows, but I am going to kill him, because it seems to make sense. So uh, let's go ahead and, you know, we'll torture you first, because why not? I feel like that's what they would have done. In fact, I feel like it is what they did before they actually killed him. Uh, we need to get our boys back down to Suffolk, so they're heading down here. We're going to go to Ipswich and siege Ipswich down and get our 100%. So I don't want to actually release this dude. I actually now want to kill him. Um, so where is you? Uh, oh, saying that, well, if we were to ransom you, uh, we'd get nothing for it. In that case, we'll just execute you, mate. You're useless to me. If I can't get gold out of you, you are actually useless. Uh, we'll enforce our demands on Baby over here. Disband the entire stack. Can we disband? We cannot. Lindsay is after me. Lindsay's after me. Like, everyone's after Lindsay. I mean, she's hot, but she's not that hot. Christ. Uh, we need to hand this land over to a child. Uh, so, I think you only picked up two. Yes, you did. So, let's grant you Lindsay. Uh, so, Lincolnshire. By the way, there was actually a kingdom of Lindsay for a little while, too. 
History of a keg. Uh, right, let's move that and recruit you to court because we can and assign and we are in debt. So, I can't ransom you for money. Uh, I can ransom you for money, but I won't take it. So as soon as we've done this war, which we've now just, we've just beaten this dude into submission, so we'll enforce the demands here. We need to go ahead and take out these boys, and we're going to go ahead and call all of our uh, allies into this, because we've got two wars going on, and I don't really want to be on the back foot and, you know, doing what we did last time around. Oh, no, no, no. Uh, we'll get a negotiated alliance going on as well. And I thought I sorted this out, but apparently not. So let's assign you, because I would need to assign someone. So, one of the three wars for this land we decided to take has been completed. We've got two more to go. Uh, I believe that these men over here are probably going to be part of the issue. So this is the... Uh, which men are these? These are the Mercians. So we can kill some Mercians here, nice and... Oh, so he says, as 1,300 Mercians just turn up out of nowhere. My son has been captured. Uh, wonderful. Uh, that didn't really go the way I planned. Do you know why it didn't go the way I planned? It's because I'm playing on too fast a speed. Uh, right, let's go ahead and get you involved. We'll get this uh, martial perk for living off the land, which is what I wanted. And we are free over because our son, I believe, was killed. It wasn't just... Yeah, he was actually straight up killed. Uh, do you have any children? You did not have any children. Hmm. And you are in prison. And I can't ransom you. <laughs> You're in prison with the bath. Okay. Um, have I got any fit zerks? I, I suppose I could just give Uber some light. Oh, Uber's dead. Has it gone to shit already? Uh, I've got a grandson. I've got myself. I can't land my daughter. Unless I just give it all to my son. Who's currently my heir. Uh, I'll just, yeah, I'll just give you all of it. Uh, well done, you've earned some land. Get in, son. Uh, so he's actually potentially more powerful than me because he's got more land than me. Um, yeah, this could be this could be going quite wrong quite quickly. Uh, let's recruit and assign. So we do have men about uh, on our side, as you can see. You've got ten thousand men compared to their two thousand. So we need those boys to pull their finger out. I don't know what happened to my men. Obviously, we got absolutely wiped. But I think they disappeared off the face of the map. Oh, no, they're up here. There they are. Uh, so let's go ahead down to Lincolnshire and unsiege uh, our land. Because that is the uh, the target of this war. So if we can get that unseaged, and then we'll siege down Warwickshire. And this is Smalander, which is obviously on the mainland of Scandinavia. Um... So that could be an issue. There's, there's, the, there's the Smalanders. Okay, so let's get these Smalanders out of the way. Let's smash the Smalanders. I'm actually going to be really annoyed if uh, they're not being sieged by uh, old Bjorn over here. It doesn't seem to be. Then for a physician. Uh, we'll just take the 15 gold one. I don't want to go into too much debt. Now, Warwickshire. Let's head down to Warwickshire. Do no more than what is necessary. And I just got worse than disease symptoms. So fucking joy. Uh, there's a thousand men here we need to kill. I need to slow this down as well because it's on stupidly high speed. And I'm glad to be well again. Wonderful. Now, there's men that need to be killed. So let's go kill these men. In fact, there's men sieging this down. We had uh, several hundred men. I mean, they're so good at following me now, but they seem to avoid the fact that there's big, large numbers of men everywhere. Uh, let's go into here. In fact, I apparently avoided the fact there was large numbers of men right there and didn't get involved in this war. And one of our champions has been slain, but I'll be honest with you. It's a little bit of an issue. Not a massive issue. Can we capture them? We can. That is the uh, leader, I believe. Yalvan. Yeah, it will be. If we can capture him, which we didn't, uh, would have been great. All of this for one county. All of this for one county. It's just mad. Absolutely mad. Are we going to be able to siege this town? It is actually uh, occupied by someone. But I don't know who it's occupied by. Occupied by me. Okay, wonderful. So I've actually occupied their land already. Let's go ahead and occupy Leicestershire. Or Leicestershire. 
Uh, Scotland is now on its way down as well. This is why Scotland is such a big issue. Um, and they are actually a massive issue. A huge issue, in fact. Uh, let's go ahead and call everyone to war. I've got a... Did I, do I still have this negotiation? I can... Yeah, lovely. So we'll negotiate our alliance. If I convert this uh, to Catholic, he will end his war. But I'm not switching to Catholic yet. Not yet, anyway. Maybe a little bit down the line, but not just yet. But I need to get these wars finished. So I could just try to white piece this dude. Which I'm going to do. We'll try to end the, uh, the Mercian War by winning it. And we'll try to bring in everyone for this war. Because apparently no one was involved at all. And we've got an alliance formed. Or you in as well. Lovely. Wonderful. Thank you. So as soon as we've got this Mercian war done, we'll uh, we'll go into Scotland and do what we can with Scotland. Until then, um, there's not really much I can do. So I don't want to white peace with Mercia. I want to get us out of debt, and I believe we can take some money off them. I want to push there. We're now pushing on here. 7,000 men there. Right, so let's head over to our capital. Enforce our demands. So we'll get paid 58 gold, which isn't huge amounts, but it is still 58 gold. And we've freed our child as well. And we are now going to head into the fray against the Scots. And they've just had Lotharingia join them. They got 3,000 men. We got 9,000 men. So as long as we can uh, sort out their boys over here, which we have, quite emphatically, 70%. So we want to head up here and start sieging down their lands. And this will hopefully give them a bit of a knockback, actually, thinking about it. This should give them a rather big knockback. And they've got Navara on board as well. They've got 1,700 men. They haven't really got too much going for them right now. Bless them. That's the first army of Elgin. That's the army there. And the king is leading it? Commander, king. Yeah, the king. Right, okay, we've got a chance here. Maybe actually just capturing the king. Which we didn't do, but we did wipe out his army. Uh, so time to siege down these lands with the help of our allies and then push him away new marshal perk uh, we'll take the Parthenian tactics it's not really I'm kind of done with the marshal tree um, we're not going to be able to get it full anyway but it'll have to do so who's our current main heir this guy over here who's got some claims but nothing else We've only got the one uh, Juki tile. I think it still gets split into multiple Jukis, if I remember right. So we're going to have to look at that. Uh, let's speed this up in a moment. We've got 2,100 soldiers. We've got 2,000. We've got, I mean, we've got more men here just on top of us, and we've got men hanging around. Let's go into Fife, and then we want to take Gary. Can you do some sieging as well? I'd really appreciate it if you've done some sieging. Like if you took Straturn, then that would be incredibly useful. Outliving a child. So one of the sons died. So we've only got one son left, and it is the... Actually, we've got two. But the eldest one's the main one. The This dude here is a little bit... That's going to be problematic, and I can't actually do anything with him. But he's a bastard. I don't think he gets anything. He's an unlegitimized bastard, so I don't think he can actually claim anything. I might be wrong. In fact, I think I am. Uh, Smelland is now going to disappear, which is why I wanted them to help me out the sieges. Why are you hanging around over there? Get involved. There's some easy sieges to be done here. Uh, so that's another siege. Uh, we can see their boys are heading this way, so we're going to take them out while we can. 81% is all right. We're going to go through these guys here. 92%. Siege us now. We should have enough after we've sieged this. 
should. We've actually got uh, a bit more to work on here, so I can <laughs> go massive. Yeah, we'll do that. Wonderful. Uh, prisoners can be ransomed. Oh, well. Uh, call on our ally. Yes, yeah, sure. We're actually on 100% now, but I want to see if we can get some prisoners out of this. We've got a lot of debt we need to fix. Siege 1, we didn't get anyone. How many prisoners have we got? Seven. Okay, we'll go ahead and force the mines. We get 78 gold. We'll drop all of our men now to span the entire lot. And we are going to ransom every single child or person we've got. We've got Queen Bertha of Alba here who should give us a nice chunk of gold. Good deal. Good deal. And apparently that's it. No, you don't wanna you don't wanna get your wife back, no? Seven gold. I'm not letting her go for seven gold, she's worth a hundred. And I can't declare a war at the moment, so we need to do some more raiding. Uh, let's go ahead, and this is this is the best part of this game, is when you're like at this stage, right at the start. I feel like currently I'm in control. Currently I feel like I'm in control. I'm not, but I feel like I am. What land is this? Okay, this is Russian land already. So we've already got Russian land over in England, which is going to be a minor issue. <laughs> he says minor like it's not going to be a big thing. It's going to be a big issue. It's going to be a huge issue. That's my land anyway. No, it's Swedish land. And then my allies, so I can't actually seize that down. We might need to do a little bit of marriage and intrigue at some point to get some of this land. 61 gold? Oh shit me, they got there first. Someone else got there first. I'm so upset, I saw 61 gold, I got fucking so, so excited and then some little prick got there first. Oh no. What's the quickest way? You're gonna make me go through all the land, are you? You're gonna make me go through all the land. Okay, I don't really want to go through all the land. It's gonna cause me attrition. Uh, let's head over to Leon again. I see nine, seventeen. Oh, there's a nice bit of gold over here. So let's go ahead and take this. Main from the main body of Wessex as well, so it should be fairly easy to sort out. Uh, is there any gold over here? There's seventeen gold to be had. I can see some. Potential targets over here, nine, nine, not amazing. In Cornwall, that's been raided already. Uh, Difford, 17, we'll do 17, yeah, lovely. Get Spymaster going. Uh, we won't require you to court, we'll just assign this one here. We've got another perk, let's go hit and run. And I suppose we can just take Strategist, if we get a Strategist. But I'll be honest here, the Marshall Tree is not brilliant. Uh, 67 gold. No, she's worth 100. I'll wait. Oh, well, shit. I got caught out by 2,000 men, which means all of that work has been for nothing because they've taken all my gold. Oh, well. Right, so what I'm going to do, folks, is I'm going to end the episode there. So we're in a different position now. Uh, we've got a smaller power base, but it's a power base nonetheless. Um, we've knocked back the Scots, and we've imprisoned his wife. So if he decides to do anything now, I will murder her. Um, but yeah, we're gonna do, we're gonna carry on with this in the uh, the next episode. And um, I'm hoping, I'm hoping we can get a few things sorted out. Like we're gonna go ahead and invite some champions in, for example. Got loads there. Uh, we are illustrious, which means we can declare war on dukies. Can we declare war on? I mean, obviously we're in debt. We need to get some money. But I think we can declare war on dukies, or maybe even entire countries. I can't remember which level it has to be to raid a kingdom. Um, but I'm going to try to take Alba, obviously. Um, and then from Alba, we can try to vassalize the Isles, maybe. Uh, but yeah, so thank you very much for joining me. Um, I don't know when the next episode will be out. Hopefully soon-ish. Um, but do uh, drop me a follow on Twitter and Twitch and join the Discord. All the stuff down below. I am live over on Twitch, Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday from half six. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I will see you when I see you. By the way, by the way, before we do go, I'm aware I've done fuck all in the way of editing. Um, it's just my style. I, I'm, I'm fully aware that some people do edit, over edit. I probably should learn how to edit. I just don't bother. Um, <laughs> it doesn't help me at all. Uh, but yeah, I don't really have the time to, unfortunately. Uh, if someone out there does want to, I know I hate the whole, you're going boost your portfolio. If anyone out there does want to sort of try to hand at editing and doesn't mind doing some editing, it will be for free to begin with. Um, 
because I'm unemployed and I can't afford to do anything else. Um, but maybe if I like what you're doing, we go down the lines, we'll have a look maybe at sharing the revenue on a channel. It's not huge amounts, uh, but we'll, we'll work it out. We'll work it out. We can sort of something out between us, I'm sure. Anyway, folks, like I say, do find me on all of those things. I'll see you when I see you. Take care and uh, goodbye.